Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a great day. It's been probably about a week since we uh, last pulled out the camera. Uh, we did go camping uh, two days ago, got back last night, and of course it was raining. And we planned on making a video, but just wasn't feeling it. I tried four or five times and to do an intro to get the video started, just wasn't feeling it and after doing YouTube for about four years now that was probably the first time that's ever happened and the ASMR of it all with the rain and beautiful campground we went to uh, Golden Ears and Provincial Park uh, and very rainforest like beautiful park huge we spent the night in Alouette South and uh, enjoyed it went down to the lake uh, it was just beautiful down there just very foggy and just visually and beautiful but uh just it didn't have it in me to uh pull out the camera uh but today we are in the manning park area and we are on top of the manning park lookout it is absolutely beautiful up here we actually came here probably about three four years ago and did a video for the adventures r us uh, youtube channel So down there, that's Manning Park Resort. Way in the distance, that's Lightning Lake. There's a campground up there and uh, it's definitely a, a beautiful little spot. And that's the highway. So we zigzagged all the way up here. It's eight kilometers from uh, where we came in down there up to this spot here. It's surprisingly pretty busy up here. A lot of motorcyclists and our beers. Last time we were up here, there was maybe two people. Beautiful mountain range here. You get a better angle of that one as you're coming up, but that's a really pretty one. So nothing special today. Just gonna be doing chicken quesadillas. It is lunchtime, so that's not a big big lunch. So I just bought uh, the maple leaf oven roasted chicken it's already cooked so don't have to worry about that just some shredded cheese that we have left over mild salsa uh, some veggies from our garden and our wraps got some chips a couple drinks so it should be pretty quick and easy so i got some uh an onion to sprinkle on top of our quesadillas from our garden and some and peppers.
definitely looks pretty healthy. And it's nice not having to cook the chicken and stuff. This is just it's super simple. I definitely didn't make this one correct. It's been a while. It'll be fine, but I should have closed it up first. That's a tiny one. Well, definitely not the prettiest, but it still tastes good. That was tasty. Now I just gotta do the dishes. Well, that was fun. Uh, some good food, beautiful views, and got to play with the chickmunks. So now we're going to head over to Lightning Lake and uh, go do a little hike. We're down here at Lightning Lakes. Uh, this is the lake that you could see uh, from way up top at the lookout. It's a beautiful spot to come during the summertime, you know, have a picnic, swim in the lake and kayak. I think fish. They have flush toilets and everything down here, which is pretty incredible. So we passed two campgrounds, uh, Skyview, as you can hear the toilet there, Skyview, 
and uh, Lightning Lakes Campground's a little bit further up that way. So we're just here uh, using the facilities and then uh, we're gonna start the hike. So this hike is uh, about 8.5 K. It uh, basically goes around the entire lake. Uh, it says it takes about two hours to complete with an elevation gain of 150-ish elevation, so not too high. Uh, but it's definitely a beautiful spot. We came here in the off season, so we didn't really get to see it, but there's all these like little nooks in the lake for people to swim and it's obviously a, a pretty warm lake uh, because and everyone is out in boats and swimming and floaties. We'll definitely have to come here and go camping. That's coming. All right. Maybe about 1.5 kilometers left. A huge shout out to the family that's in, in front of us. Started the trail backwards and not at the, I guess you could say the end of the trailhead. Uh, and then we ran into that couple and uh, they've been telling us this whole way, which way to go. They'll just kind of stop, point and uh, continue on. So thanks guys. Not so sure if you will ever see this video, but that's right. We appreciate you. So we're basically right across from the main beach area in the parking lot. So this end of the lake is definitely the smallest. You can see way over there. Not too much further to go. See all the kites flying. Well, we made it to the other side. Parking lot's just over there. By far the easiest eight kilometer hike we've ever done. And we did it a little over an hour. I'll have to go back and look at uh, when we first took our first video because then I could kind of tell there. So we'll put the time here. And obviously if you're a semi-active person, the time will be a little bit different. Oh, this is the dam that they talked about. That's a, that's the smallest little baby dam ever. See that? To open the water from this side, or maybe it's to let the water in on that side. Definitely a beautiful campground. It's a beautiful area. Lots of to do. Hiking, kayaking, boating, fishing. Yeah, some of this campground is open during the winter, Cheyenne just said. Uh, so you can do ice fishing, snowshoeing, skiing, all around year fun. But uh, we're gonna get back to the truck and uh, head home.